Welcome back to Lou's Reset. This is your girl Lou and this will be an update on all the products I got from AliExpress. I feel like people haul stuff here all the time and you don't never really know how it worked out long term. Like you'll see it a couple times and then you never see it again or never hear about it again. And I feel like at this point like somebody got to start coming with it again with this. So I'm going to be the one to be honest with y'all. So let's get into it. If you haven't had a chance, go ahead and comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, and push that notification bell so you can know when I upload. For the month of May, I'm uploading every week just so that we can get more acquainted. So without further ado, let's get into the first little item. This is the brushes I had got from AliExpress. Um, I, I'm going to figure out how to share the vendor. In fact, I will be putting up a better video of these brushes. You got 12 brushes for $29.95. Um, if, if you've been on um, YouTube for a minute, or if you are one of those girls who follow people who are beauty gurus and people who get um, like mail from brands. Sorry, you guys, I'm in the process of trying to depot some things um if you are one of those people who do get products bling brush had been out last year and it was like a big thing like all of a sudden these brushes they're blingy they're pretty all the gurus were putting them on their stations they were getting pr mail from them and they were sharing with you and then i looked it up and those brushes are 160 dollars one hundred and sixty dollars for 12 brushes yeah the room got quiet i personally can't say i wouldn't value the brushes i think they probably would be very beautiful they're probably well put together the craftsmanship on them is probably great however i personally cannot see myself at this point in life knowing what i know um purchasing a hundred and sixty dollar brush set now i could spend a hundred and sixty dollars on some, some some brush sets but on a brush set mm -mm, no baby it's not gonna happen so i feel like this is a good dupe i'm not gonna say it looks anything like the real bling brushes because everybody who's shared the bling brushes they like kind of do this little thing and you see it and but you don't really see it see it up close and them you know so i feel like they looked really pretty and at least maybe i didn't see any video that where they were super up close with their brushes so i wholeheartedly just feel like uh, oh sorry i got the hiccups at this point for me it it it's a beautiful thing and i definitely admire the people who have them however a, a knockoff is good for me because sometimes um i'd rather have more more items like yeah more quantity than quality with certain things like i feel like all makeup brushes pretty much do the same thing i got the morphe brushes i got beach my cosmetic brushes i had got some sigma brushes and some mac brushes sephora and Alta brushes and then i got cheapies like um wet and wild um elf the old school elf the new school elf shop miss a and then some off of um, ebay amazon aliexpress and i can honestly tell you to me the performance there was not a super humongous difference in the performance of the brushes so i definitely can say if you don't have that coin and you see other people um here on youtube or instagram or tiktok um and you're looking for something that could kind of possibly mirror it um what i did on aliexpress is i looked up bling br makeup brushes and this is what i found and they have so many blinged out things like there's a mirror for your vanity um there's two different ones that i was looking at one's like 75 dollars, and the other one's 45 dollars um one the one that's 45 dollars has lighting the one that um that's 75 dollars does not however um those are the items i have been looking at and i can honestly tell you that i definitely definitely have a lot of respect for the brands that manufacture these things because i wholeheartedly um appreciate the lower price point now let's get into the next thing this 
was from Amazon. The, the, uh, it slipped my mind. The tweezer holder came from Amazon. Great, you know I'm tired. Um, the tweezer holder came from Amazon. I will be 100% honest with y'all. Um, I really enjoy this tweezer holder. However, 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 I feel like um, it makes me want to find just the Aurora Borealis looking ones, these ones here, and fill it up. I could have swore I got a four set with the first one. Like, it was this and two more things i know i had got the eyelash curl curler and one other item however my daughter swears i didn't but I, I i digress um i definitely 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 do plan on purchasing more aurora borealis looking tweezers because i do want to fill this up and just have those tweezers on it and then all the rest of my other tweezers i definitely will be um getting rid of because or giving to my daughter because those are not the tweezers of my to choice my tweezer choice is the aurora borealis looking ones because for me that's the aesthetic i go for like when i look at it i want to look at my desk and have either this or something like this just like crystally nice organized um looking uh vanity now, the next thing I purchased were these eyeball razors. These came from Al, um, Shein. No. Yeah, Shein. And they look like this. And I am really digging, if you guys haven't noticed, like clear, opaque looking things. I am into shades more than colors. Hence, like a lot of the stuff in this room is about to be changing, like these cords. And everything I'm going to be covering pretty soon. Um, I do have this stuff to do it, just not the time. So um, I definitely, definitely can say they are worth the splurge. It was three for a dollar off of Shein. And I definitely plan on repurchasing those with them. Then the next thing that I purchased and received recently, and I never even showed it in a haul, so I wanted to share with you guys were these lashes I got two different ones they both came with these kinds of tweezers and spoolies um I'll be honest they were worth the splur the money I spent on eyelashes because eyelashes are a splurge to me like you I, I feel like they complete a look it's like having curtains up to your window you got beautiful windows it could be very clean however when you're home you want to close the curtains so that the whole neighborhood is not invited in so that is definitely definitely um more so my type so moving on to the last product i wanted to share with you guys and i know this one's gonna take a little bit longer but i wanted to be 100 percent honest with you guys i did get this turmeric soap set i got the the cream a bar of turmeric soap and these two an oil and a serum i have a dark mark that's been here and it was way darker than this like a month ago and it is clearing it up I will be 100% honest with you. I feel like these products do work very well. I did not purchase anything that would bleach out my skin. I do not want to be lighter. I just want to even out my tone. Um, and I can honestly say to you guys that those products do work. Now, the only one that does really smell immensely a lot like turmeric is the oil it's the turmeric oil and you see it's orange like the turmeric um so to me it's like okay what did you expect it was gonna smell like turmeric i mean it says it's turmeric on the outside so i definitely definitely feel like it's a good product line um it was only 18.95 i definitely plan on repurchasing with this particular um vendor i'm just going to be like along with the brushes I just have um not purchased in a long time like these items were out for delivery for uh, a month or two before I received them so just because I'm sharing with you now does not mean <laughs> that I ordered them recently they I have been waiting on these for quite some time now 
if you have any questions or comments, like I said, put them below and I'll see you guys next time in Lose Reset.